chapter 10 now those that seal were nahamaya the tarshata the son of kakilia and sidekia seraya aseria jeremaya pashur amaria malkija katush shebanaya maluk karim meremoth obadia daniel ginaton baruk meshulam abia mijamin mayashia bilgai shemaya these were the priests and the levites both jeshua the son of asaniya binnui of the sons of kanadath katmiel and their brethren shebaniya hodisha helita pelaya kanan mika rehob kashabia zakur terebia shebaniya kadosha bani beninu the chief of the people parosh bahat moab yalam jatu bani bunni asgad bebai adonisha bikwai adin atir ishkisha asur kodisha hashum peshai tarib anadot nebai mikbiash meshulam etsir meses abel shadok saduya pelatia kanan ananiya kosheya kananiya kashup kalohesh pileha shobek rehum kashapna maseya and ahisha kanan anan milluk karim bayana and the rest of the people the priests the levites the porters the singers the nethanims and all they that had separated themselves from the people of the lands unto the law of god their wives their sons and their daughters every one having knowledge and having understanding they clave to their brethren their nobles and entered into a curse and into an oath to walk in god's law which was given by moses the servant of god and to observe and do all the commandments of the lord our lord and his judgments and his statutes and that we would not give our daughters unto the people of the land nor take their daughters for our sons and if the people of the land bring war or any victuals on the sabbath day to sell that we would not buy it of them on the sabbath or on the holy day and that we would leave the seventh year and the exaction of every debt also we made ordinances for us to charge ourselves yearly with the third part of a shekel for the service of the house of our god for the show bread and for the continual meat offering and for the continual burnt offering of the sabbaths of the new moons for the set feast and for the holy things and for the sin offerings to make an atonement for israel and for all the work of the house of our god and we cast the lots among the priests the levites and the people for the wood offerings to bring it into the house of our god after the houses of our fathers at times appointed year by year to burn upon the altar of the lord our god as it is written in the law and to bring the first fruits of our ground and the first fruits of all fruits of all trees year by year unto the house of the lord also the first born of our sons and of our cattle as it is written in the law and the first lings of our herds and of our flocks to bring to the house of our god and to the priests that minister in the house of our god and that 
we should bring the first fruits of our dove and our offerings and the fruit of all manner of trees of wine and of oil unto the priest to the chambers of the house of our god and the tithes of our ground unto the levites that the same levites might have the tithes in all the cities of our tillage and the priest the son of aaron shall be with the levites when the levites take tithes and the levites shall bring up the tithe of the tithes unto the house of our god to the chambers into the treasure house for the children of israel and the children of levi shall bring the offering of the corn of the new wine and the oil unto the chambers where are the vessels of the sanctuary and the priest that minister and the porters and the singers and we will not forsake the house of our god